Greetings from Wastel. This is Patrick from the support team. This tutorial is to demonstrate how to use the Wastel integration commands. The set of features puts the power in your hands because you can not only send messages but also create templates and send them directly to WhatsApp for verification from Click as well as see a list of approved templates in addition to those pending and rejected and even send templates with parameters directly from Click so your agents can personalize your messages to clients in a quick and easy way. Now let's have a look at how we do these commands. We always start with slash and dash, so slash w space and then dash and here's where we select the command we want to use. Here we see the ones that are related to templates. So first there's the new command with creation and sending of templates. There's the list command which shows you your list of available templates as well as those pending and rejected. And the send command for sending templates with parameters. We'll start with the new command creating a new template and sending it directly to WhatsApp for review. Using the new command will open up the, the template creation wizard. With this you select your code. The code is what you will use to reference that template. We always started without the hashtag or pound symbol and you generally use lowercase characters and only the underscore allowed as the non-standard character. The category is important for WhatsApp review because they use that as part of their criteria for determining what the template is going to be used for and therefore whether it will match with their policy. For the language we would normally select For the language we would normally select the international version of the language. However you can also choose, if you so desire, the local dialects of the language. We click next to move on to the remainder of the template creation wizard. In the template creation wizard you will see where you input the header, the body, and the footer. A standard template message would be just the body, so we would select none for the header and leave the footer blank. You can also, however, add text to make the message appear as though it had a title. The header text will appear in bold above the message. You can also send images, video, or documents with the template. To do so, you merely input a publicly available URL into the URL field. Bear in mind, this URL has to point directly to the document or video image, and it cannot be a link to Google Drive, Dropbox, Zoho Work Drive, or if it's a video, it can't be linked to YouTube. WhatsApp will be looking for links directly to your website, and it has to be publicly available. For this example, we're going to use a standard message. So you input the body. The body is the text of the message you would wish to send. It's best practice to end this with a call to action to get your customers to reply and open the 24-hour session window. In the footer, you can also write something to be separated from the body that appears as though it's a signature. For instance, you might get a message from us saying, From Wastel Support Team. If you see it in grey at the bottom, that was used as a footer. Then you simply press Create, and that will send the template directly to WhatsApp for review. Now we're going to have a look at the list command. This is how you can see your list of templates that are available. So if you put in slash w space dash list, it will show you the list of available templates that you can send at this time. For us to look at ones that are pending approval, you just add another character afterwards, in this case p, and this will bring up the menu of available views of templates. You have approved, which are ones that can be used, pending, which are ones that are currently under review by WhatsApp, and rejected. If you have a look at the list of pending templates, you'll see any that may still be under review by WhatsApp. Bear in mind, it takes a few seconds for this list to populate, so if you have just sent a template for review from WhatsApp, it won't appear for a minute or two. If you want to send a template as normal, you just put in the slash w command and then copying from your list of available templates you can copy the code and paste it after the w command so slash w space and the template code including the hashtag at the start will allow you to send a standard template if you wish to send a template with parameters use the slash w space send command that's dash send from the available list you select the template that uses parameters and you will see a field below Simply input the value that you want to have, showing where the template parameter should be. And once the message is sent, that parameter field will be replaced with the text that you have inputted into the parameter. And what the customer will see 
is simply the message you wanted to send along with your own personalization. If you have any further questions about this, please do not hesitate to check our Help Center website, which is available directly from your list of pending templates and the other commands within Click. Alternatively, drop us an email at support at wastel.com.